Hey, what's up guys, Brandon here, Legacy Real Estate Team, Monday Motivation. Hope you guys had an awesome uh, 4th of July Independence Day week and uh, Independence Week overall and uh, America's birthday. Uh, just so grateful and uh, just blessed to be in this country, in this in this spot. And if you're listening to this video right now, um, just blessed to be able to have internet connection and to uh, have access to things like that. Just absolutely incredible what we are, are gifted every single day. And it's something that I literally wake up every single day. I just want to talk about the money motivation, just you know, gratitude, empathy. Um, I was real burned out the last week or two, uh, probably last week or two. And um, I stupidly really don't um, plan as much vacation as I should. And uh, I think I'm superhuman. And Probably always will, and it's not good, and it's not good for me, it's not good for my health, not good for my family, not good for our clients, not good for uh, providing the absolute best service that I can, and my job as a business owner is to uh, you know, put our people in positions to succeed, and put our clients in positions to succeed, and um, I just really had not rested enough and not put myself in the best position to serve everyone else, so um, last week was awesome. Got to spend a lot of time with family, and I hope you did as well. And uh, got to recharge, relax, rejuvenate. It was incredible uh, weather here in Michigan. So hopefully you got to do that. But um, it's just I wanted to talk briefly, like I said, Monday motivation about just resting and relaxation, and and doing that to serve yourself, but to actually serve your family and your clients and your or your boss or whoever it is. You are really and being an athlete my entire life, I should know better. And it's, you know, you need rest and recovery. You need that ability to recharge and rejuvenate yourself. And it's just something that I, I wasn't doing. I really hadn't done. I was sick the first the couple months of the year. I was sick about four times and, um, it just caught up to me and, um, it's not good. And it's a vulnerable state. You know, you're in a position where you, you shouldn't be vulnerable, but you are, and you're putting a lot of things at risk. So, um, I got to recharge last week. I hope you got to recharge. If you didn't, go recharge. Seriously, it's one of the best things you can do. Go get a bunch of sleep. Go take three days and recharge and relax. Take your family and do that. It's just something that, again, I I should uh, have done uh, more of this year already. And, uh, you know, going for 16 hours a day isn't good. You know, with some young kids, um, you know, on, on the way and, and things like that, it's just not good. You have to take care of yourself or else you can't take care of anybody, right? Just like, you know, it's kind of like in an aircraft when, you know, they're talking about putting the oxygen on, you got to put your oxygen on first, right? You got to put your oxygen on first, then you can go help someone else. It's the only way you can't help someone if you, you know, don't have the resources or you don't have the health or you don't have the wherewithal to go do anything, right? So make sure you're taking care of your own body, your own self first before you're going to do anything else. It's literally the number one thing you would do or else you're useless. And then not only that, other people are then having to take their time and resources to come help you, which is not good. So take care of yourself first. Um, it's something that I'm glad I, I caught it before I did. Um, and I was just lethargic. I was just out of it. I was, you know, doing work at home in the evening. I was just like out of it. I was just like zoned out. It's like, oh my gosh, like what? You know, like what? What am I doing? Like what's going on? And it's just like really weird uh, feelings, things like that. It's just like that burned out feeling, and uh, it's just you know I'm now ready to go, ready to rock, and um, it's just you know we only need a kick in the butt once in a while. So I um, hope you had a, an awesome week. Like I said, hope you had some awesome weekends, awesome uh, Independence Week. Um, what a what a time to be alive. That's for sure. We literally are the most blessed generation that's ever been in recorded history. Like we had it we have it the easiest. I mean, all of our parents, grandparents, great everyone had it so hard. War, you know, just insane things going on and we have the internet. You know, we can't, you know, our our biggest challenges are, you know, trending, you know, hashtags and things like that. Like um you know, it's just, there's obviously things in life, there's bad things, there's good things, there's always going to be some of both, right? And uh, it's our job to wade those waters and uh, and be resourceful and be impactful and be rejuvenated and recharged that we can attack those things head on. But what a time to be alive. What a, a time to, to be alive and have the opportunity that we have, opportunity with the internet, um, you know, free things in our life or very cheap things that no one ever could have imagined. Um, and the, the business you might work for or the businesses you might own have such a leg up compared to everyone else. Think about you're thinking about your grandmother, think about your, your grandmother, your father, your great grandmother who wanted to get ahead, wanted to go work, try to work two jobs or three jobs. They 
literally had to go physically. They couldn't do anything else. They couldn't go on the internet and work. They couldn't do a side hustle somewhere. They had to like go actually work another job and physically kill themselves to go do that. So to, to make a better life for themselves and you, your family. And uh, so just so blessed, so grateful for what we have. And uh, just want to make the most of it. So that's why I wanted to talk about just rest and recovery today so we can make the most of that, all of us. So I appreciate you guys a ton. Love you all and uh, appreciate it. Like I said, all the comments, DMs we get all the time. And every time I see you guys, the comments, um, just love it. So we love bringing you guys this content and uh, there's a lot more in the way and uh, some cool stuff, um, even better stuff as we go. So stay tuned. Have an awesome week, guys. We'll see you soon.